the Stratford Beginners Novice Maiden Chase next then, and a three mile and a furlong this time, top one and the address, Martin Leedham, Backstreet, Billy, CDF, Carrick Hill Lad, John's Jumpers, Case Closed Legacy, Paul Rhodes, Chocolate Cake, Joshua Sutherland, Gengar D. Thompson, Gunfire, Leon Van Rensburg, High Smile, Doug Warren, Police Grove Lad, Jay Murray, Shadow Service, Grey, Garbo, Turbo, Blake Acid, Hoik, M. Cairns, Magic Morning, D. French, Princess David Robertson, Shine, Kylogs, D. Hinton, Sophie Ridge, Graham Clutterbuck, Spiralite, Thunderspot, Sweet Sphinx, Darren Howells, The Bike, Colin Clark, Yarazal, Gene Rosen, and Zero Sunshine, Molliet's Surfer. So, 21 of the men, they're going to start off on a bit of a hill, and up and down they go, and race towards the first of 19 fences and case closed legacy on the outside it looks like it's going to be the first one to take them over it bit of a slow jump though and they're all safely over the first uh, Gengar is now probably just the leader I'm sure the Gengar was around last season I think he might have been case closed legacy is named after the grand national winner of course as they take fence number two and Gengar in the lead from Case Closed Legacy in second, and a very, very short one to the third. They've already jumped three fences, and they haven't travelled that far. And they've all jumped them okay as well. So it's Gengar, Case Closed Legacy, and Shine Kyloads. They've already taken number four, and they've lost one of them. They've lost two at the back there. That was the bike and high smile. So there's nothing for the trainer to be high smiling about there, I'm afraid, as that one is out of the race along with the bike. So racing down towards the next then, and... Gengar has got the lead from Case Closed Legacy and then Shine Kai Logues. After that one comes Shadow Serve and Carrick Hill Lad. Spiralite is the grey on the inside, I think. And then comes Hoik and, and the address is quite close. Gunfires after that one and then Magic Morning. And Yarazal and Princess Zero Sunshine's in mid-division with Backstreet Billy and Garbo Turbo and Police Grove Lad as well. And Sweet Sphinx, Sophie Ridge, and finally Chocolate Cake. So, still a long way to go. And Gengar will take them into this next one in the lead. And they're all over that one. No, they're not. There's another one gone. And the address is a faller there as well. So, that's another one out of the race. And over fence number six they go. And Gengar is the leader. As he comes into number seven, they're finding these fences a bit stiff, some of these novices. And I think we lost another couple there as well. Just the one, Sophie Ridge has gone. So four fallers already then, as we come up the straight for the first time. And we take fence number eight, and we're all safely over that one. And it's Gengar in front from Case Closed Legacy in second. Spiralite is third, and then comes Shine Kylogues four. Gunfire is five, and Carrot Hill Lad is six. Shadow Service next, and then Hoik and Magic Morning, and Yarazel, and then Princess, and Sweet Sphinx, and Garbo Turbo, and then Backstreet Billy, and Police Grove Lad after that. Zero Sunshine, and finally, Chocolate Cake. So, down to fence number nine they go. This is the water jump, and they skip over that one. Expect anything to fall there, and they've all got that one, got over that one okay. With Gengar just showing in front by about three parts of a length. Skips over that one nicely in the lead. The rest of the field jumping it well as well. It's Gengar, close, close legacy, Carrick Hill Lad in the white sleeves is third. Then comes Shine Car Logs in the yellow fourth. And they're over that one as well. And the grey in the yellow is Spiralite. And just behind that one in the white colours is Hoik. And then comes Gunfire. That's a little bit of a gap then to Shadow Serve and Backstreet Billy and Magic Morning and Princess. But there's still a fair old way to go, less than a mile and a half, and Gengar is the leader. From Case Closed Legacy in second. I mean, Yarazal has gone at the back as well. That might have been either out of shot or I wasn't paying attention, but there's there five gone. So Gengar is in the lead. And Case Closed Legacy is second. Carrick Lad is third. Shine Kylogs is fourth. Then Spiralite is five. And Hoik is six. And Gunfire is seven. And Magic Morning is eight. And then Shadow Serve is nine. And Princess is ten. And then Sweet Sphinx and Backstreet Billy and Zero Sunshine. And then Garbo Turbo and Police Grove Lad. And finally Chocolate Cake. But all the remainder are still in with chances. There's just a little more than a mile still to go. And Gengar in the lead from Case Closed Legacy and Carrick Hill Lad. Here comes the 12th. And the leaders are all over that safely, but a slow jump by the grey towards the back. That was Princess. 
but they're all over it okay. And now to number 13. We have a downhill fence this one, and they skip over that one okay as well. And Gengar being joined on his outside now by Case Closed Legacy. Carrick Hill Lad and Spyrot sat closely behind as they stream over that one. That was number 14. And there's just over six furlongs still to go. Case closed just in the lead as they take the next. Quick jump by the leader. One or two slow jumps in the pack. But it's Case Closed Legacy and Gengar who suddenly pulled four lengths clear of Spiral Art who's been pushed along to try and join them in third. Gunfire is next. Then Carrick Hill Lad Princess has made some good ground from the back. Then Shine Carlogs and Hoik. And Shadow Sir Zero Sunshine and Sweet Sphinx. Then Magic Morning. That comes from a stable that has some closers that like to come with a run at the end anything beyond that one I think you can just about forget but they've got four furlongs still in a race and case closed legacy on the outside of Gengar then comes Gunfire and Spiralite and Carrick Hill Lad and Princess and they're beginning to bunch now at the front Hoik is just tagging onto the back of them then comes Shadow Servant Zero Sunshine pretty much everything else is out of it I would say as they come down to the 16th and over that one Case Close Legacy didn't jump it well and Spyrolite jumped into the lead Spyrolite's now the leader here's the third last Spyrolite takes it well Case Close Legacy takes it well as well in second these two have pulled clear I'm sure it's between these now Hoik's running on into third over the second last Spyrolite in the lead Case Close Legacy second big gap back to Hoik in the remainder but Spyrolite's got to jump the last to win it I think Spyrolite comes up to the final fence he's in the lead he pops over it nicely not such a good jump by case closed legacy and spiralite is going to race up towards the line and take this one it's a good win for spiralite sat quietly in third most of the way around spiralite the winner case closed legacy is second hoik was third princess was fourth and carrick hill that chocolate cake ran on well from the back and the field will trail back to magic morning but spiralite wins it for thunder spark Case closed, Legacy was second, Hoik ran well in third, Princess was fourth and Carrick Hill Lad was fifth and it's worth mentioning Chocolate Cake who was closest at the finish and was running on well.